hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video so on today's video i'm going to show you guys how to add um, chapters on your video on youtube now i'm going to explain this very quick so um let me show you guys my existing video this is actually my existing video and this video currently do not have a chapter you can notice it's straightforward video and when i scroll down you notice there is no option like chapters right here and if I click on the more section, it's just my description that is showing right here. Now, um, guys, if you not want to know how to do this, I'm going to create a video later on on how to do this on mobile. So, um, come over to this particular video. This is a different video entirely. You can notice this is my video TS Tech Talk. This is how to turn on auto caption, and this is a different video um, Windows 11 update major update, and is by a different channel. This is um, Joe. So um, that is the channel name. So this particular channel, if you notice right there, they have um, different, like if you notice there is a cut, um, you might not see that properly very clear from my screen, but I'm very sure you, you are going to see it on your own screen. They are like a broken timeline under this area. So that is actually the chapter. Now, if you notice under this area, just after the mic and the volume, you notice it number and then next it says um how to get when you click on this arrow right here it's going to display um some information right here showing chapters now this is the chapters of the video and when you scroll down you can see everything display properly from the beginning to the ending of the video so if you click on anywhere it's going to navigate through that timeline and bring you to that particular timeline that you just selected so these are called chapters on youtube but you can also call it a timestamp most people use timestamp i think on my previous video i used timestamp for it because i also know this as a timestamp so but um for some reason youtube actually titled these chapters so i'm going to be showing you guys how to do this and also guys um little more information if you click on this more section you are going to notice where the person says timestamp right now um Apart from adding this particular link, even though you do not add this, all you need to do is to add these numbers, the timing of the video. All you need to do is to add the timing, where the video started, even though you don't add where the video started, add all of this information, different chapters of the video, and it's going to perfectly have this particular option and this option. And if you notice on this, my video, I do not have that option. After the timeline, it's um, autoplay. There is nothing here. It's supposed to be right here. And also on my description section, which is the reason why I open it, nothing is here. And if I scroll down, you can see there is nothing there. So let's go ahead and add this. So in order to add this, you make sure you are, you are, you are the admin of this video. Go over to the edit section. But if you um, have access to your um, YouTube studio, just click on the YouTube studio and then click on that particular video. You are good to go. But for some reason, I already opened YouTube because I'm showing you guys example. So I'm going to click on edit video and it's going to bring me to the same um, studio.youtube that you guys will also open and edit your video. So now um, let's wait for it to open. Now this video has already loaded. So this is how to add a timeline. My phone just fell down. This is how to add a chapter on your video. Now um, you know how it started. Just go ahead and add um, timestamp. And quick note, guys, this particular um, title is actually not very necessary. What is actually very important is starting of the video and then keep going. And also, guys, it doesn't actually mean if you are starting it from zero ratio zero zero. So um, there is a mistake. I keep adding this all the time. So it doesn't actually mean if you started like this and then say um, in true production. And then you click on enter and then you keep adding more now in order for you guys to know where the video started you need to actually play this video you need to play this video to certain timeline of the video and wherever you want this video to start okay let me give you guys an example let me play this video right now i'm going to mute it so that you won't hear anything um i'm actually going to navigate because i want it to go away so now you notice this actually started right here now if for some reason i said um I just pause the video right now this is on 0 19 seconds let's go back to 19 seconds this is 0 19 seconds so i can come right here and say um 0 19 
um, check in, check in, uh, Android. checking Android version so um, after adding all this stuff this is actually what is going to make up our timeline but in order not to make this video so long I'm going to pause this video while I add all of the remaining timeline now I already showed you guys the trick of adding the timeline you need to have the video playing once the video play you can pause the video and you notice this particular section this is actually the timeline where the video is currently on and this is where the video ended so this is what I'm going to copy and then um, type out on this particular section so I'm going to keep playing the video and then whenever I get to a specific timeline I write it down and until I end this video or until the video end so until I'm tired of writing the timeline or until I no longer want to add those timeline probably the information on the video is no longer that relevant you can just leave it that way so let me go ahead and pause this video and add the remaining timeline and then i'm going to play this video back so guys i'm done adding the timeline and then um you notice this guy actually added something else to the description this down arrow you can also add the same thing but i think um i'm going to add a different thing to my own and i'm going to add a timer right here now um, let me go ahead and paste it because I already copied it and guys if you want to know how to add this timer make sure you watch um, my uh, YouTube shorts and you're going to learn all of these things now in order to add this timer you need to open this URL once you open this URL um, it's called unicorn or unicode table unicode dot table dot com and then once you have that open go ahead and search for time this is actually what i search for but if you want to search for that guy's particular arrow this is what it's called it's called down arrow down arrow and then you hit enter so when you um search for down arrow it's going to display all of the down arrow and i think the guy actually made use of this one so all you need to do is to come over here next to this area click on copy once you click on copy come over to your video and then paste it watch let me paste it right here now you can notice the arrow displaying right here that is exactly how the guy added his own so if you are okay with that one leave it there and if you're done click on save and i have saved the video so let's wait for the video to completely save you notice the video has been saved right now now let's go ahead and click on view on youtube to display the video on youtube and then wait for it to play now um it's usually play advert so i'm going to pause this video till the advert finish playing all right guys so you can see right now that our timeline is now displaying and if you click on this area it's going to display the chapters right here and you can notice they actually started from the beginning and ended where i stopped but this is actually not where the video stopped if you notice right there this video is actually ended um, actually ended in three minutes um 34 seconds but i stopped writing my timeline in two minutes 29 seconds because the rest of the whole conversation was just um how um how the um live caption on samsung actually went so this is actually how to add it and if you notice everything right here let me show you guys i forgot to show you so let me show you the description how it looked like you see how the description looked like the timer appeared and everything appeared perfectly well so um i assume guys this is actually all you need to know on this video and also you notice it's now perfectly the same with this guy's own so if you guys have any video um any question or any video request leave it on the comment section and this is actually how to create chapters on your youtube channel and i hope this video is helpful if it is don't forget to smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video i will see you guys on my next video please stay safe and peace I actually didn't want this to